my name is Ikmore Omba Oze, and um, I'm from Nigeria. The 5th of April 2023, the good news and my life changed. Wow, that is brilliant. It is so inspirational. So through this program, I'm at my, I've achieved my dream because it was depressing coming, working as a nurse in my country and coming here, I couldn't practice what I've loved to do. So now I'm excited, now I'm happy, now it's a dream come true. I've been a nurse for like 20 years. Wow. In, yeah, in Nigeria. So I moved, I, I did the general nursing and I and I did my specialty in um, mental health nursing. I moved to Canada five years ago. I did the um, one year program in Canada too, nursing program, bridging program. So I needed a booster dose. Booster dose I for got, uh, Rexpian. I got from yeah, <laughs> from this program. That is I saw the program online. Okay. On Facebook, yeah, I saw the program on Facebook. And I checked the success rate, it was so high. Like I saw, I, I keep seeing, the, um, when I checked the dates of the exam, yes. I was seeing the recent dates. I yes. said, wow, for NCLAS, for RESPIAN, for CPRN, I said, oh my God, what kind of program is this? So my computer shut down at 91. I thought there was a problem with the computer. Okay. Yeah, because I thought, I didn't know I was doing excellently well. Yes. I knew I was doing well, but excellently, I wasn't sure of that. So I have to call them like, please come, my computer shut down, come and help. <laughs> oh, so, so when You definitely come, did exceptionally well in your exam, you know, that's why computer shut down at 91. Yeah, at 91. And during the exam, there were questions, I, when I see any, the question, I'll say, this is Taryn. So imagine <laughs> me. <laughs> so I'm supposed to click the option, but I have to call her name first. Like, oh my God, I got this quest. I had this, this, and I, I listened in class. So I followed Taryn's advice. That's try and use the language. So after reading it in Canadian way, I have to read it in my own native language, which is Benin. Wow. My so first I one hour, I think I did like, 40 questions my wow. first one hour. So you were going slow in the exam. I was going so slow. So there were questions I saw like this quest exactly the way she said it. I was like, oh my God, this is starting. This is starting. This is starting. <laughs> you you were very consistent and yeah. you attended every single class. Taryn was receptive. She kept to, she kept her calm. Listen, she said, no, Ozzy, listen, don't think. So I, I, <laughs> Even when I was doing my revision, I was just, I kept hearing her voices. Even in the hall, when I was writing my exams, I keep hearing Ozzy, Ozzy. That name kept coming. Ozzy, choose rightly. Ozzy, don't rush. Ozzy, look, read again. <laughs> there was really no challenge. That's so, amazing. Yeah, there was no challenge. There was, everything was okay. The, the, it was a friendly environment. It wasn't judgmental. Yes. So we have few blacks or few of my race in the class. Yes. I know the class was dominated with um, other like Indians. Yes. But I'm just saying that I am a Nigerian. I'm not an Indian. I can't speak Indian. I don't understand Indian languages. But every if the class is for everyone. Yes. So if I can be there and I was able to achieve my goal and my dream, so everyone from any part of the world you can join. And we are still so excited and like like my husband this morning was saying, I can't I can't still believe this is real. Oh my like, god. Like That's even me incredible. myself, like for the past two days since yesterday, I couldn't eat nothing. Like I'm just full because I'm excited, I'm happy. Hello everybody, this is Taryn from Future Building Nursing Prep Center and I am today with my very special student, but we <laughs> call her Ozzy with love and uh, Ozzy is from Nigeria. She has passed her RexPN exam in first attempt with FBNPC with 91 questions. 
So, Ozi, welcome and thanks for joining us in this podcast. Do you want to introduce yourself to our audience, please? Yeah, my name is Ikbome Oomba Oze, and um, I'm from Nigeria. I moved to Canada five years ago. So, I did the one year program in Canada too, nursing program, bridging program. Okay. In, um, in, um, uh, practical nursing. Nice. So I just I wrote my exam on the fourth of April, twenty twenty three, and I started at eight a.m. So when it was, I spent like um, two hours thirty minutes for ninety one questions. Wow. So I I listened to what Taryn told us in class. Do not rush. Take a break when you're tired. So I didn't rush. I my first one hour, I think I did like forty questions. My wow. first one hour. So you were going slow in so the exam. I was going so slow, and I have to read my read the questions twice. So I read it once. So the second one, I read it, read it in my language, what mm-hmm. I speak. So I followed. Parents' advice that's try and use the language you understand most. So after reading it in Canadian way, I have to read it in my own native language, which is Benin. Wow. So Benin. I did that and yeah, Benin. 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 So that's, yeah, okay, Benin that's language. the language which you speak. Okay. Yeah. So I did that and I applied the um um priority. I I took like I always like the move two from it. Uh, I used a current streak, true or false. So when it's a false, I know this is false. So actually during the SATA, I applied true or false. So Amazing. and um, I kept there. Were, I she always tell us look for the cash in the world. If is if the, if you are told is um give patient for that teaching, that means. There is a negative statement in the option. So I applied. And during the exam, there were questions. I when I see any, the question, I'll say, This is Taryn. So <laughs> imagine me. <laughs> so I'm supposed to click the option, but I have to call her name first. Like, oh my God, I got this quest. I had this, this, and I, I listened in class. The first thing I want to advise everyone is that don't miss don't don't miss classes because I'm not too good at going to watch recorded videos, but I want to be there so I can ask the question. Yes. I want to see her talk. I want to participate. I don't want to live there. I want to. So I was always in class. I was in class hundred percent. Even yes, the last Ozi, day. That's true. <laughs> I agree with you. You were very consistent, and you yeah. attended every single class. Yes, I did. And the questions I don't understand, I'm like, oh, no, Taryn, this question, I don't get it. It's not supposed to be like this. Is it like this? I like sometimes I just feel um, maybe I I was talking too much. But Taryn was receptive. She kept to she kept her calm. Listen, she said, no, Ozzy, listen, (laughs) don't say so. I I even while I was doing my revision. I was just, I kept hearing her voices. Even in the hall, when I was writing my exams, I keep hearing Ozzy, Ozzy. That name kept coming. Ozzy, choose rightly. Ozzy, don't rush. Ozzy, look <laughs> read again. Yes. So, I, her voice helped me. Her words helped me. Her counseling and making me know that, like, sometimes I'm like, for that statement, what does that mean? So she made it simpler for me to understand that when you have further statements, uh, further teaching, it means there is a wrong statement in the option that patient needs to be uh, reinforced. So like this thing you said is not right. So there were questions I saw like this question exactly the way she said it. I was like, oh my God, this is starting. This is starting. This is starting. <laughs> so I was really, I even felt I was disturbing others because I felt so excited. It was really nice. This program, I saw the program online. Okay. On Facebook, yeah, I saw the program on Facebook. 
and I checked the success rates, it was so high. Like I saw, I, I keep seeing, um, when I check the dates of the exam, yes. I will see the recent dates. I yes. said, wow, for NCLAS, for RESPIAN, for CPRN, I said, oh my God, what kind of program is this? So I was, I, I was the one that wrote to them, like, can I know more about this program? Okay. So that was how I called this office and everything. And that same day, I agreed that, okay, I'm going to participate in this program. And I have no regrets. And um, even when my computer shut down at 91, I thought there was a problem with the computer. Okay. Be yeah, because I thought, I didn't know I was doing excellently well. Yes. I knew I was doing well, but excellently, I wasn't sure of that. So when you definitely did exceptionally well in your exam, you know, that's why computer shut down at 91. Yeah, 91. So I have to call them like, please come, my computer shut down, come and help. <laughs> oh, so, <laughs> because I thought, I, I didn't know it was really, that was the pass. Because yes. Sarah made it so easy for us to understand, for us to, I applied the strategy. Like, oh, listen, look at it again. Pick what the sentence she told us one thing like that most times the answer is in the question that's true so i applied everything our voice kept echoing ozzy you can do it ozzy keep going ozzy keep pushing so that today, is amazing we are so, so proud grateful. of you thank you so much so grateful Thank you to for this program. Thank you to you too for I'm choosing happy. our program. And you know, this is my next question, which I wanted to ask you was like most of the time people, you know, um, like coming from different communities because internationally educated nurses are coming from lots of different countries here in Canada, right? So did you find anything difficult in our program, which was hard for you to understand um, in terms because you're from Nigeria, you know, and uh, anything which was, not good in our program or which was hard for you to understand? I I think there was really no challenge. That's so, amazing. Yeah, there was no challenge. There was everything was okay. The the it was a friendly environment. It wasn't judgmental. Yes. So we have few blacks or few of my race in the class. Yes. I know the class was dominated with um other like Indians. Yes. But I'm just saying that I am a Nigerian. I'm not an Indian. I can't speak Indian. I don't understand Indian languages. But every the class is for everyone. Yes. So if I can be there and I was able to achieve my goal and my dream, so everyone from any part of the world, you can join. And the success is you gotta be. I, I remember when they told me the price, I was like, no, I can't afford this. So the person I spoke with at the office told me, you can make this money in one week. Yes. When you become a nurse. Yes. So that that was the day I said, oh my God, I'm paying now. Because if I can make it in one week and just imagine someone failing and you're going to cry for like one month, you're going to be dead. So there's no regrets. So don't really think of the money. So the money is just too little compared to what you're going to achieve. Exactly. And that's a beautiful yeah. message. Thanks, Ozzy, for sharing this message because sometimes, you know, people are hesitant, but you are exactly right. You are even going to make more in that one week what you are actually paying for the program. Yes, yeah, sure. That is amazing. Tell me something about Nigeria. I want to hear, like, how is nursing in Nigeria? What did you do back home in Nigeria? Uh, I've been in nurse for like 20 years. Wow. In, yeah, in Nigeria. So I moved, I, I did the general nursing and I and I did my specialty in um, meta health nursing. Wow. So I'm a meta health nurse and I work as a meta health nurse in Nigeria. I have worked in the uh, med surge. I worked in psychiatric uh, clinics and um, I have a lot of experience. That's impressive. Coming, yeah, coming down to Canada, um, CNO, they said I my three years um, competency has uh, expired. So if either I go back to my country or I could do a one year bridging program. Okay. So I chose to do the one year bridging program. So where did, where did you do your bridging program here in Canada? Algonquin College. 
Okay. I've gone Queen College here in Ottawa. In Ottawa. Okay. Yeah. And so then you I, find that program helpful to you guys? The program was not um it was helpful, like knowing Canadian stuff because I think I know nothing not nothing in terms of uh, like maybe like talking about the lab values, the same thing almost all over the world. Mm -hmm. But the ethical ethical part of it not same with where I'm coming from. Okay. So I learned at school, but the um, not enough. I needed maybe because the program was a short program, so I needed a booster dose. Booster dose I for got, uh, Rexpian. I got from yeah, <laughs> from this program. That is amazing. And Ozi, I want to ask how how does it feel after passing the exam? How does your family feel? Yeah, we are still so excited and like. Like my husband this morning was saying, I can't, I can't still believe this is real. Oh my like, gosh. Like That's even me, beautiful. myself, like for the past two days, since yesterday, I couldn't eat nothing. Like I'm just full because I'm excited. I'm happy. I never yes. knew this, this could go off me so soon. And um, I remember last month was my, supposed to be my exam. I sent you a message that, can I, that I want, my exam is this, this. You, you asked a question. Have you watched all my videos? I said, no. You said, why? So then I have to change my dates. So I said, I have to finish this class. Let me yes. finish to the end. So I changed my dates on the 4th of April. So because I knew the class was going to end like on the 30th or 31st, so I know I'm, I've, I've gathered everything I really wanted to know. So I don't want to wait too long. I said I want it to be a week after the program. So that was, I changed my dates to on the 4th of April. And yesterday, the 5th of April, 2023, the good news and my life changed. Wow, that is brilliant. It is so inspirational. I'm pretty sure people who are watching you, they can understand that this exam is not just an exam. It's a life-changing exam. Yeah. Uh, for the individuals, for their families, right? So that's like very, very important. So Ozi, I want to say a really, really thank you to you for coming on this podcast and sharing your valuable experience and sharing your time with us because that means a lot, you know, and you guys are coming forward so that you can inspire future internationally educated nurses, uh, not just from your own home countries, but from, you know, they're coming from any country and they will be listening to you. So Ozi, mm -hmm. any last minute tip you want to give to the students? Yeah, I'm still very excited to be here. Like, my Canadian dream has come to pass. Wow. Through uh, Tarrant's program, FBC. Did I, <laughs> I know, it's just so, it's, it's, it's <laughs> a tricky one. FBNPC. I totally get it. <laughs> <laughs> so, through this program, I'm, I, my, I've achieved my dream because it was depressing coming, working as a nurse in my country and coming here. I couldn't practice what I've loved to do. So now I'm excited. Now I'm happy. Now it's a dream come true. And um, I have ATT to do my um, my class. I was so, going to say that next, yeah. actually. I was going to say that, Ozzy, do you know you can write NCLEX? Because yeah. you have your three years and now they have changed lots of rules and regulations. You can get the eligibility. But you are already pro, man. You have already yeah, done it. That's so cool. <laughs> I have my like uh, I uh, with new grocery, so amazing. So I'm planning to do to I'm going, I'm still going to enroll for this program again. That's I call a long it Tarrant's Tarrant program. That is, <laughs> <laughs> well, that's so kind of you. Yes, it's a long name. So, Future Building Nursing Prep Center. You know, I yeah, totally get it. So I am I am planning to to enroll again for my N class in few months from now. Amazing. Can't yeah. wait to see you as RN. You already have got RPN title and, uh, you know, we'll do another podcast once you are registered nurse, right? So that's amazing. Yeah. Well, enjoy your success. Thank you so much for coming and giving your valuable time to us and sharing this Thank information. You. Thanks, Thank Ozi. you so much. Yeah. Thank okay, you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.